Hi, my name is Eric Dunn, co-founder and CEO of Rever. And in this video, I have your questions that I've received about continuous improvement in Kaizen. And the next question that we have today is, how do you measure the productivity of a continuous improvement program? And what should you expect as a good productivity rate? This is an interesting question because um, first we need to answer what is productive, right? And in my view, a productive um, signal is when an idea is validated. Whether you validate whether the idea worked or not, and if it worked, you get it implemented, but at least making sure that every idea is validated. I would not measure only return on investment or how much savings you're generating because then you limit the participation of people. Um, and, and if you only measure also implemented ideas, I mean, most systems have less than 10% 10, 10 of ideas implemented, which is tragic. Um, if you treat every idea as an experiment, not just as a suggestion, but as an experiment, and as such, you invite people to, to try out their own ideas and validate whether they work or not. Even if they don't work out, they will capture the lesson learned and then come up with a new idea. And if they do work out, at least you have some basis of the, um, that justifies that the idea could go forward and get, get implemented. Uh, that is the ultimate expression of a productive continuous improvement system when you treat every single idea as a potential experiment.